The Enchantment of Celestia, A Princess's Quest for Harmony. Once upon a time, in the kingdom of Avernia, there lived a princess named Celestia. She was not just any princess. She was known far and wide for her kindness, intelligence, and love for the natural world. Celestia had a deep connection with the enchanted garden within the palace grounds, where flowers bloomed in every color imaginable and magical creatures roamed freely. One sunny morning, as Celestia strolled through the garden, she noticed that the once vibrant flowers seemed dull and droopy. Concerned, she approached the wise old gardener, Amara, who had tended to the garden for generations. Amara, what has happened to our garden? Celestia asked, her voice filled with worry. Amara, with a sigh, explained that a curse had befallen the garden. The curse, cast by an envious sorceress long ago, drained the life force from the plants and animals, turning the vibrant paradise into a shadow of its former self. Determined to save her beloved garden, Celestia embarked on a quest. She consulted the kingdom's scholars, delved into ancient books of magic, and sought advice from mystical creatures that dwelled in the nearby forest. After days of research and exploration, Celestia discovered that the only way to break the curse was to find the Tears of Luna, rare magical crystals hidden in the heart of the Whispering Woods. Armed with courage and accompanied by her loyal companion, a winged fox named Aurora, Celestia ventured into the Whispering Woods. The forest was alive with whispers of ancient secrets and hidden dangers, but Celestia pressed on, guided by her determination and love for her kingdom. As they journeyed deeper into the woods, facing trials and overcoming obstacles, Celestia and Aurora encountered a tribe of forest sprites. These mischievous yet friendly creatures agreed to help Celestia in her quest, intrigued by her pure heart and noble cause. With the aid of the forest sprites, Celestia reached the crystal grove, where the tears of Luna grew beneath the moon's gentle glow. However, the grove was guarded by a formidable creature, a guardian spirit named Sylvanius, whose task was to protect the crystals from those who sought to misuse their power. Sylvanius, impressed by Celestia's sincerity and bravery, challenged her to a trial of wisdom and empathy. Celestia listened attentively to Sylvanius's tales of ancient times, shared her own experiences and dreams for a harmonious kingdom, and showed compassion for the Guardian's lonely existence. Moved by Celestia's understanding and kindness, Sylvanius granted her access to the Tears of Luna. Celestia carefully gathered the shimmering crystals, each one reflecting the moon's ethereal light, and thanked Sylvanius and the forest sprites for their guidance and friendship. Returning to Avernia, Celestia used the Tears of Luna to break the curse that had plagued her garden. As the crystals infused the soil with renewed magic, the garden burst into a riot of colors, and the creatures within it danced with joy. The kingdom rejoiced as news spread of Celestia's triumph. She became known not only as the Princess of Avernia, but also as the Guardian of the Enchanted Garden, a symbol of hope, courage, and the enduring power of kindness. From that day onward, Celestia dedicated herself to protecting the natural world, ensuring that harmony and beauty flourished in her kingdom and beyond. And so, Princess Celestia's legacy lived on, inspiring generations to come with her tale of bravery, compassion, and the magic of love.